Three quarters have come and gone. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. Desperation time, Mayfield. What's up, everybody? It's David from Bald Guy Media. It's week three of the YouTuber Fantasy Online Draft CFM. I got the Chiefs. Let's look over his team real quick. He's got Marcus Mariota at QB. And down at uh, RB, he's got the Cook Brothers. And... Nope, fullback, of course. Oh, man, he's got Cheetah, Tyreek Hill, Marquise Goodwin, uh, Thornton. He's just got speed everywhere. So this guy's going to be looking to bomb me deep. We've got the Mack truck, Mack Collins, tight end Isaiah Likely. I mean, he's got a pretty decent offense here already with the skill position guys. And his O-line looks okay so far. I mean, not great. <laughs> But um, maybe they can block good enough. But, yeah, no one over 80. So, sometimes ratings are just ratings. But he has J.J. Watt and Von Miller. You got some older dudes there on uh, the ends. But um, in the middle, he's got Reader. Um, <clears throat> so, he's definitely got some guys that could get to the quarterback. But they're definitely older, so... Who knows if uh, they'll be around much longer if we progress uh, as DBs or so-so. No one over 81. So he definitely drafted for offense in the CFM. Uh, Diggs, he's, he's not bad, um, but he's slower, so he probably got him a little bit later. And then Jimmy Ward's rounding out his team here. So uh, interesting to see what he's going to do. Probably he's going to bomb me. Hopefully not. So here we're going to look at his uh, past games real quick. His week two opponent, uh, it was a really close game, and his opponent threw an uh, interception to lose the game. And it, it seemed to be like an epic comeback, but uh, he quit. So his stats for week two are, are um, a force win, so he really can't go by them. And Yeah, not throwing too much. But you got to worry about Tyreek Hill, obviously. So um, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try to let not let uh, Tyreek Hill beat me over the top. That's that's my goal, you know. Good luck to Dalvin Cook, but uh, I'm not letting Cheetah get over top. And then quick update: Slinger one throwing motion for Baker Mayfield. Let's try to throw some better passes this game. And with that, let's get right into it. Sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Today, it's week three, and we've got a good one in store between the Kansas City Chiefs and the Indianapolis Colts. We get the ball here on offense to start the game, and right out the gate, he gets a sack on me because he's got his X Factor lit up all game, I think, and Man, we just missed a deep one there, so already off to a bad start. And look, it's about to get worse when you see this. Punt block. Don't pick it up, please. Yes, they do, of course. And for two games in a row, we have given our opponent touchdowns on our opening drive. So we are off to terrible starts in back-to-back -back games. Um, and you're going to see in this game that... Uh, he does it twice. Almost does it twice. And right back on offense again. And we're 0 for 2. So let's get the run game. Not really much here. Five yards. Already in a third and long. And, I mean, we just get lucky here making a move. Not really great stick by him. <clears throat> so, uh, get the first down at least. You know, right back to Dariki Young. And going to try some pass here. And... I just get it in there. Um, you know, like I said, his DBs aren't the greatest, but um, here, I, 
I made a bad. It looks like I made a bad read, and my running back didn't come out of the um, backfield like he's supposed to. So, luckily, uh, I didn't complete that. But right away, he's just got me bagged up. So he gets the ball back. He didn't block the punt, and he's running the ball here with Dalvin Cook, which is fine. Not letting him beat me over top. He's probably just trying to feel out what my defense is. And right here he goes for the read option with Mariota, and we get a fumble recovery. Finally, something goes our way for once, which is awesome. So, yeah, it wasn't good. So he got the ball back already. I skipped over my three and out. Uh, I learned how to block the punt, which is good. And he's just running the ball here. Running, running, running. He had to uh, hurry up on this and went to run to get some yards back. And here we go. We get a nice sack, fourth and 22. He punts. I get the ball and make a nice little read here. I probably had that play over the top. Bateman back to the run with Young. Not doing so well with the run. And I just don't know where to go with the ball here. And I get sacked. Well, almost sacked. Get the ball out in time. Uh, look at that. X is wide open. Well, not wide open, but X is open. I could have got him. And he get the ball back now. Right back to Cook. He still hasn't really taken his shot over top, but uh, we're playing good defense. And right here with 20 seconds to go in the half, we get the turnover. Let's go and try and score a touchdown. At least kick a field goal. So... <clears throat> Gets a pass break up here, second down and 10. Do some crossers. Uh, I know on his stream he criticized me for running that play, which is fine. Go to the flats. I I'm just not being able to read his defense that well. Um, so I'm going to take my three points here and at least try to get the game <laughs> Uh, closer, but uh, the kick meter was way too slow for me, and it's going to end this first half 7 nothing. None of us have scored an offensive touchdown. He hasn't completed a pass yet, and um, he's going to start the second half with the ball, and he's running with Cook. Almost get a sack here or a D-line pick, but nope. Right back to Cook. Gets the first down. And he goes back to Cook again. And I don't know what that tackle attempt was by 55 was, but missed Dalvin Cook. And there he goes, his first offensive touchdown of the game. He still hasn't completed a pass yet, but he's up 14 0. So, of course, we're going to keep giving the ball to Dyrick Young. And I mean, the only passing I can see. What I'm playing is the quick flats. He tried to read it there. I got it out far enough to Young again. And I think at this point he knows that um, I'm trying to feed Young the ball there. I made a really bad pass play. And I couldn't get him to miss this time. So it's fourth and one. And we make a call here. I just get the first down. But I thought I was going to score on that. And I might have hit turbo too quickly. Going with... Play action play here. I don't know how he didn't pick that off. But like I said, his DBs aren't that great. I can't believe he got this sack. I thought it blocked it better. I think I would have had a completion. But here we get ourselves at a fourth and five at the end of the third quarter. Pretty much the game on the line. I need to score here to make this a game. And of course, we're going to go for it. You saw this play at the very beginning of the game. And it's a very important game. Or Important game, important possession here, and make a bad play call. His, I think he's got zone drops there. He's not a man. I thought he was a man, but he's in zone, and he makes a great play. And I'm just like, get hope, hoping Gray breaks breaks the tackle there, but nope. And then almost another sack, D line pick. Nope, stole no completions for Mariota. He's 0 for 3 and an interception. And there he gets me with Thornton. Gets that speed. I caught a cover 2 and he got me there. And now he's up 3 in the fourth quarter. And I 
misthrow this. I mean, if I pass lead this properly, I throw a proper pass. I think that's a touchdown right there, but nope. And now I'm pissed. I can't believe I threw that wrong. So I definitely have to learn how to throw better. But you're going to see I missed a couple deep ones throughout this game. You saw on the first drive, uh, well, yeah, the first drive of the game, just overthrow. That was an underthrow. Uh, so he's got the ball. He's going to give it to Cook. I don't know how he didn't get in there. Wish he would have, but he no huddles me. And I kind of knew this was coming, but I just didn't adjust correctly. So it is what it is. I mean, that is murder. Goodwin assaulting Casey Hayward. I mean, Casey Hayward is just freaking toast. He's just getting burnt. And he's a lollipop. He is, he's the lollipop. He's just, he just keeps getting licked. So we're, I need a score here. Look at that. Uh, I probably had another touchdown to square, but I got sacked. And that's not a pick, thankfully. Third and 13. Go with the out route. Um, if you want to know why, there's a little exclamation point above these guys. Um, it, because it's on a red route, and he can read that with his defender. And then here we finally break a run with Dariki Young. Can't get in, but get him up to 71 yards rushing. Go with slants, and uh, his own played that with a knockout nicely. But do the stretch to the outside, outside zone to Dariki Young, and he gets in. So, you know, this game's pretty much over, maybe, 28-7. You know, <laughs> This guy didn't throw a touchdown until the fourth quarter or complete a pass. And this thing just falls apart. I mean, now he gets a, a long pass to Hill. Thankfully, we catch him. Uh, he knows huddles me here. I'm trying to make adjustments. And it goes to the two-minute warning. And then this is a uh, touch pass to Young. Not Young. This is a touch pass to... Uh, Cheetah gets the backflip, and I, I mean, just unbelievable how he took that to the house. But that's what it, it is. What it is. This I slipped on the button, or else that would have been a completed pass to People Jones. So now I have my second interception, and this game is pretty much over. I played to stop the run, and he threw a streak. First cover zero to Cheetah again. The cheat code, and. There you go. Nice user by him. Luckily, we get the fumble back. And now here's that play again. And it's a bad throw again. Unbelievable. Get the in route. Peoples Jones. And we get the first down. And I'm just trying to, like, you know what? I'm going to get some reps here on offense. I need to really get some reps. This is only my third game. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, like what I'm looking at and take uh, a sack there and that's the game. I mean, this game went on for a while. Uh, it might seem like it was a quick game, but it definitely was not a quick game. Um, the uh, Just a lot of back and forth, incompletions on both sides. You know, he, he didn't complete a pass until the fourth quarter, which is a touchdown to Thornton. That was his first completion. He was 0 for 3 before that and with an interception. So um, getting a little bit better on defense, but I really need to improve more on offense because I have not scored many points in these first three games. So I need to get better quickly because we're 0 3 and week four is coming here soon so let's go meanwhile for the Colts the early struggles continue as they'll sink to 0 and 3 and they'll be at home next week for a date with the Tennessee Titans